Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about this glueless full lace unit from ozowigs.com. I'm going to go ahead and hop into the specs of the hair first. This wig is 150% kinky curly lace wig, short with blonde highlights. It's 14 inches. It's a glueless lace cap. It's uh, The lace color is medium brown and the hair texture is silky. Um, this wig company, I believe, is a new wig company. I don't really see reviews for them on YouTube, um, but they do remind me a lot of RPGshow.com. Um, I love how fast the shipping is. I got my package within about two days, which is awesome because nobody wants to wait for their hair, right? Their, this is their box that it came in. I really love this box. It has like this little magnetic little thing to keep it closed. And um, on the inside was just the wig. And the wig came nicely wrapped. I'm going to post pictures of all that at the end of the video. comes with a nice brush. Um, one of the uh, armband, I guess this is what this is. A wig cap. This wig cap is a little too dark for my skin, so... I would suggest that they ask um, bef w before they send out the wig caps, like, you know, do you need a dark brown wig cap or you need a, a light brown one because this, I will never use it. I can't. So just to keep from wasting their money and waste, and you know, me just throwing stuff away and collecting more junk, um, they might want to ask, like, what color is your scalp, light or dark? And also it came with this cute little, um, Thing. At first I was like, what the heck is this? But then I messed around with it and it opens up into a nice little bag. And it says, oh, Zo Wigs, Beauty and Style. I like that because you never know where you might end up. You might have to throw your wig in a bag overnight, okay? Just saying. So, on to the hair. Now that the boring stuff is out of the way, I love this hair. At first, I was a little scared because I don't ever go for styles short like this, but I'm really feeling it. And I think the pop of color, the blonde highlights that they put in or light brown highlights, it's just really like, I love it. I love it. The only thing that I did to this hair, excuse me guys, I'm sick. The only thing I did to this hair was I washed it and conditioned it. And I'll post pictures at the end of the video so you guys can see what I use, what products I use. But the reason why I washed and conditioned the hair is because it smelled like corn chips. And I just, you know, the hair is so close to your nose. Like, I just don't want to feel like I'm smelling like Fritos all day. So I went ahead and conditioned it. But one of the great things that I can say about this hair being the that it's curly is my fingers run right through this hair and not only that I have yet to get any shedding that is awesome because my last curly unit that I had it was longer than this but even during the washing process hair was just coming out coming out coming out and I'm like oh my god so just to have this unit with no shedding at all is freaking amazing but like I said this is my initial review I haven't even had this hair in my head for a week so I will you know post another video here within about 30 days just to let you guys know how it's holding up and I'll also post some updated pictures um, on Instagram and I'll put that information down below if you guys want to follow me I did a middle part but you can part this unit wherever you want and I'm gonna just do a demonstration for you I'm going to part it on the side. You could part it on the side if you'd like. And all you would have to do is just manipulate the part a little bit to make it look more like your own. And I love how this comb is just like literally sliding through this hair. I love that. Um, I do have a black cap underneath because <laughs> I just had a black cap on it. So, <laughs> anyways, um, what I did to make my part look a little bit more natural is I use my 28 color palette and some powder I use the powder closest to my skin tone and then also I use the black powder and the reason why I use the black powder is when you do your part if you just put the black powder 
where you're um, like on the out, outer perimeter of your part, it will make it look so much more natural. So yeah guys, this is my initial review of the OZO or OZO wigs dot com full lace glueless unit. I absolutely love this hair. Here's what it looks like from the back. Hope you guys can see. I'm in feeling this for the summertime. You can't tell me nothing, honey, at all. And it's short and it's so lightweight. Oh, and another positive thing that I want to say about them is all of their wigs are 150% density. You can't even get that at, I'm not going to say no names, but majority of the popular wig companies that we see on YouTube, their max density is like 120%. All of Ozo's wigs or OzoWigs.com, all of their units are 100 minimum 150% density so you know for sure if you're gonna get a straight unit if you're gonna get a curly unit it's gonna be full and that's what I love because I cannot stand spending you know three hundred dollars for a unit you get it and it's so thin and sometimes you end up adding tracks to it and you know so you don't want to deal with, deal with all that when you're spending so much money for hair I don't think they understand how expensive this this stuff is you know so anyways I do have a discount code for you guys though I will put that in the description box below and I just yes I'm feeling this hair I'm sorry you guys I'm gonna be looking at myself taking selfies all day long ain't worried about it so anyways i hope you guys really enjoyed this video don't forget to rate comment and subscribe and stay tuned for updates on this unit and i will talk to you guys later bye okay guys so that is the box that your unit is going to come in and that is what they put on the side of the box just letting you know what kind of unit you have there's my wig nicely placed in that bag and also it comes with brush, a comb, a wig cap, a armband, a bag. <laughs> so they load you up with free goodies when you purchase a unit from their company. This is what the unit looks like when I took it out of the box. It had some paper stuffed inside looked very dry but it was actually really really soft there's the inside of the unit it comes with two adjustable straps in the back and it has three combs in the front this is a full lace glueless wig cap the knots on the unit are not bleached but it is 100 percent human hair so you can bleach them yourself if you would like to i do plan on doing that i want to record how i do that so stay tuned for that video this is what the unit looks like directly out of the box. No styling. I haven't cut the lace yet. I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like directly out of the box. So it's kind of wild and in desperate need of some attention. And please excuse me for not having any makeup on. I am fighting a very bad cold. Those are the products that I use to wash and condition the hair. And that's just what the hair looks like once it's been wet. The curl pattern still stays the same. It did not turn any funny colors when I washed it. And it was just so beautiful after I washed it and conditioned it. The texture was even more softer. And like I told you guys um, in my review, there's no shedding at all so far with this unit. I absolutely love it. Okay, so one of the things that I definitely want to point out about this hair is that I have not gotten any shedding. And I'm extremely surprised to have that outcome with curly hair. Most of the time with curly hair, for me, it always sheds more than any of my other kind of hair. But I've played with this hair, I'm washing this hair, and I still haven't gotten any shedding, guys. That is awesome.